a new art gallery has come to downtown Brentwood. The aptly named Gallery on Second celebrated its grand opening last weekend with a reception featuring many local artists. This is a professional gallery and we'll have high achieving amateurs or semi-professionals as well as professionals from around the country. We're primarily going to concentrate on um, Contra Costa County and the Bay Area. This community is growing with a lot of people that came from other places where they were accustomed to going to galleries and theaters and we haven't had that here. And now this is my attempt to have it here and then the next thing of course I'm, I want to build a theater. On behalf of uh, the Brentwood Chamber of Commerce, we welcome the new artist studio to Brentwood. The gallery was praised for not only its content, but also for its layout and location. I love it. I haven't seen it before. It's beautiful. Oh, the gallery's great. Compared to the, the concrete floors and concrete walls that it was last year, this is incredibly nice. It was uh, really nice. It's laid out pretty well, a lot of glass, which is good for a gallery. I think it's great. It's a, a prime location, and I think uh, it'll be very successful. The secondary purpose of this event was to provide a preview for the upcoming 2012 Artist Open Studio Tour. So this show in particular is a show that features some people that are on an annual tour. It's called the Artist Open Studio Tour and the public has a chance then to drive from one location to another and discuss art with the people who create it and that always happens in about the second or third week of May. This year it's on 11, 12, and 13th of May. And so the first show in the gallery is a preview of that. Every artist that is on the tour has one piece in this show. The weekend is Friday, Saturday, and Sunday in this case, and so you have plenty of time to make it to, to more than one. There are a total of 21 locations with 42 artists. The artists here all agree in the importance of bringing art into the community. Well, art is an important part of culture and history since people lived in caves. And it's, uh, it's something that actually is very soothing to look at. Most people don't realize that there is a brain connection between art, mathematics, and reasoning. So art is important in a community so that the children can learn to make these connections and to increase their intellectual understanding of what goes on around them. Today is, was a tremendous success. We had a, had a lot of people. We had four people from uh, Livermore. We had two people from Walnut Creek. Uh, it, it just was warms my heart that there's so many people interested in the arts. And frankly, it was so full at one point that there were people standing outside waiting to get in. I loved it. <laughs> this is Austin Cook reporting for the Press.net.